Hey everyone, it's Olivia, and in my AppSci 101 class, we were given the task of designing, constructing, and programming a fully autonomous claw retrieval system, kind of similar to the ones in like the toy vending machines. And yeah, I had so much fun working on it, so I can't wait to share with you guys. <laughs> I guess that works. So it's Friday night, and the competition is on Tuesday. I'm back at home and I'm going to stay in tonight to finish some parts of the poster like the orthographic drawings and the risk assessment since the poster is actually worth 60% of the mark. So this is my final design sketch and I'm going to call it the basket claw. Basically there's a little baby servo motor attached to this arm which will move it back and forth. There's a trigger over here which will slide up and down and Sliding upwards will complete the circuit and this arm will move back and forth. So it is currently 1.47 a.m. on Tuesday and the competition is in less than 14 hours. I just got in contact with some of my group members and I found out that we didn't actually get our poster printed because the place that we went to had really weird hours and we weren't able to get it printed in time. So I'm kind of stressed out but fingers crossed that we can work something out. I'm Victor. I'm Zohair. I'm Harry. I'm Zayfar. I'm Annabelle. <laughs> so this is our poster and overall it turned out pretty well. We ran into a bit of an issue because the printing place closed but Zuzu found another place that was open and we're all good now. Okay so for this competition there are three separate rounds. The first one is the variety round where your claw tries to pick up as many different objects as possible. The thing that makes this round more challenging is that the objects are just so different. There are some small objects, some round ones, and some just really weirdly shaped ones. And the second round is the precision round where you try to pick up and put down some intricate blocks of Lego. And then the third one is the cooperation round with two other groups and together your claws pick up bigger objects like noodles and baseball bats. Yeah, now everybody pull up, pull up, yeah, 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 yeah. So the claw project is done and out of the way and looking back on it I was really really happy with the results. Our claw ended up picking up 11 objects and both of the Lego pieces successfully um, and also the instructor came up to us and told us that out of all the claws so far our claws picked up the most amount of objects and I think the next closest claw picked up seven objects so my group was really happy to hear that and overall it was a really really fun project working with my team and yeah that's all for now thanks for watching and see you again soon